structural we want to draw a heat exchanger coil at the bottom of the tank and variables we will be using are uh, the coil will have a pitch of 95 millimeters, a height of 900 millimeters, a radius of 900 millimeters and an angle of 0 degrees and we want the whole coil be raised by 100 millimeters. So let's get going. Let's open the tank. And let's uh, remove the visibility. And so what we want is going to part then click on parameterized geometri geometric primitives and select helix next we need to remember the pitch was 95, the height was 900, the radius was 900, no angle and we want the coil to go into the Y direction and we want the coil raised by 100 millimeters so that it doesn't is not stuck at the bottom of the tank. Let's create. Yes, that looking good. So we're happy with that. Close. Next we want a pipe cross section starting here okay so we want to draw a circle in the said y plane let's go into part design said y plane and this is where we want the circle the radius of the circle is meant to be 30 mil then the distance to the origin is 900 mil and the distance the circle to the origin is 100 mil so it now coincides with the start of this helix finish editing it's looking good next we want to sweep this pipe along the helix let's rename this pipe and go into part and then select sweep utility and now we want to sweep the pipe cross diameter cross section along the helix so you need to select the helix here 
then click OK. Now this is a computationally intensive application and we need to twiddle our thumbs and here we go it has generated the helix the pipe heat exchanger let's introduce a bit of transparency so you can see we now have inserted a heat exchanger into the tank using the helix and sweep facility. Thanks for watching.